Following the disappointment of their defeat to Uruguay in the quarterfinals, Ghana's World Cup squad met Winnie Madikizela Mandela, the former wife of South Africa's former president, Nelson Mandela. Getting so close to becoming the first ever African side to reach the semi-finals was consolation enough, though, for coach Milovan Rajovac. This is the, the biggest success in history of Ghana. Ali normal. But of course, we said after you know this match, you know we wanted to, we deserve to go through. We had the opportunity to, 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 to qualify for the semi-finals to be amongst the best four teams in the world. I think Ghana deserved that. A penalty shootout ended Ghana's hopes for the tournament, but Solomon Tari says his teammates are looking to their next challenge and learning from the tournament. I don't know. It's it's it's, it's a game. We can't say we robbed, but. Uh, we didn't, we didn't, we got the chances, but we didn't utilize it. So this is not Robin, but uh, we lost the game. So it's, we're not here to criticize anybody, but uh, we will try best to do our things next, next yeah. time. All the same, Ghana are now the toast of the continent, with local well-wishers in Soweto mobbing the side to greet them and take photographs.